Good morning. I bumped into Richard and Wendy on the coastal path and they're just we're going in the opposite direction to me so what's your plan today then Richard where are you going? Oh Jim we're off to St Aldham's Head um, it's a bit of a bit of a trek a little bit of a trek and then back into uh, Worth with Travers for a, a pint at the Square and Compass. Yes it looks a very attractive pub I did pass it this morning. It's a glorious pub one of the old-fashioned type pubs where you can get uh, yeah, spit and sawdust. The meal, the meal choice is a, is a, a pie and a, and a Beer choice is a pint, and that's about your lot, but it's uh, well worth a visit. Well, that sounds very encouraging. I, I mean, it's my, I, I arrived in Swanage yesterday, so I haven't had a chance to look around. The one thing that I'm impressed with at the moment is that you can park on any car park in in the town for, for 24 hours for a pound. Is that right? I didn't even yeah. know that. No, yeah. and that, that, includes, that, must that be, includes that camper vans as well. So that'll so. almost certainly change come the uh, the season when the season well, starts. Oh yeah, I'm sure. So. I mean, I've been I've, I've spent maybe what three or four days in in the Weymouth area, and, and it's eight pound there. Is it? Yeah. Yeah, and they really chase you around as well. I yeah, we know. we always in Swanage we always park uh, in one of the side roads that we know very yes. well. And yeah. do, do a lot of walking from, from Swanage, so yeah, it's a, yeah. some lovely walks from there. I haven't been to Swanage for many, many years, but uh, I'm also encouraged that we've got a railway line there. It's Beautiful a steam little railway, steam engine, yeah. I noticed steam Flying engine. Scotsman's there in a couple That's of months. That's right, yes, yes it is, yeah. yes. Yeah. Yeah, it's so, definitely. Yeah, it's something to look forward to yeah. at the end of March. I, I might even come down for that. It's that well worth time. seeing the engine go, when you're going from Corfe Castle, you yes. to Corfe Castle, and you can see, the, yes. see it coming past the castle. It's really, yeah. really attractive. Yeah, I was surprised it's, it's running now. They were, they were steaming it up this morning. They were, yeah, it was running yesterday, so running today, it's yeah. Just, just weekends, obviously. I, I would imagine it's probably because it's half term as ah, well. Ah, that as well, of course, yeah. yeah. And so have you both been avid walkers all, all of your lives together then? Or, or is it is it just no. something more five, of a... Five years or so, yeah. isn't it, really? Sta think, started yeah. off as circular pub walks. Ah. Um, short circular pub walks and, and has progressed to longer and longer circular pub walks. Right. Are you going to publish it? Send no, it on no, the market? no, no, no. <laughs> No, well, it's lovely to meet you two people. You, Jim. Uh, very nice indeed. And you've got a card there. You'll be on YouTube tomorrow. Lovely, so. Joe. Thank you. And uh, it's been a pleasure to meet you. Especially, thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Thank, thank, thank you. Right, well, here I am at Hook, and I've met these, these people. Your name, sir, is? I'm Robert. Robert. Caroline. And, and Caroline. And uh, we've just been having a quick chat. And, and you was telling me, uh, Robert, that you... you you just about to sort of embark on walking as a, as a well, way of keeping fit. This um, is like a, I've got to lose some weight, yeah, and it's a good sort of gentle way, so like of doing it. Yes, absolutely. And we're planning to so like on sort of building up from here, so start yes. off so like with a few five milers and then go up to ten mile. Yes. But the um, the intention so like is eventually to do the Camino. Really, that's that's a very unusual objective. Uh, uh, something abroad like that. I mean, is it? Uh, are you familiar with the area and stuff like that? Then? Well, yeah, we've just been watching like yeah, YouTube it's vlogs. Like a, we've been watching vlogs. <laughs> oh, you've, you've been watching vlogs. Well, that's interesting. Vlogs well, that's a there, good yeah. way of doing it, actually. I mean, I know some of them are, are really good and some of them are not so good, but nevertheless, you do get a lot of information. It depends what yeah. you're looking Absolutely. for. Absolutely, yeah. It's yeah, so like because it's all it's um, sort of all planned for you. Yes. So yes. all the accommodation, so like, is there along the way. Yes. But um, yeah. it's literally sort of getting up to that uh, 10, yes. 15 mile a day sort of yes, absolutely. Uh, distance. So it's going to take a while. Yes. Well, I mean, if, uh, I sound as if I'm, uh, if I can recommend a lot of my, my vlogs, uh, uh, give you every day that I've done for the last two and a half Well, we've got your card, days. so I can, we're so going to give, you, you, a, can have a give look you a, there. a and, what? And they're all around about sort of 10, 15 miles. Yesterday, uh, it was my one year since I actually started the walk. Mm -hmm. And I've done 209 days, an average of 14.3 miles a day. Right, OK. And uh, so, you know, that that's a good thing to aim at. I, I mean, well, as, absolutely. as for you... Well, you, you can't really sort of uh, get a better country, really. So like that, um, it's amazing. The walking, so like in Britain, so like is probably from? second to none. Yes, I started off on the east coast at Grimsby and walked. Okay, yeah. I'm doing it anti-clockwise. I walked mm. up the coast to, to the Scottish border and had to make a decision whether I was going to do 
wow. Scotland there and then, but I didn't, and I went across to Carlisle instead, mm. and I've walked all the way down to Lands End and all just on oh, all right. the south west yeah, so coastal mm. path, got to Pool, Bournemouth. And, yeah. and now I'm, I'll be in Portsmouth by the end of today. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And it's gone extremely well and I, I've loved it. And just well, to say... Because we've I, been round um, Pembrokeshire, we've walked along the coast like there. And it's that's fabulous. amazing. Yeah. So. And, um, you know, I'm, I'm really pleased to hear that, you, that you, you're going to get yourselves out there because I, I lost a lot of weight. I've lost two stones since I started this. Well, I'm, into, I'm wearing size 30 waist jeans now. It's the first time I've done mm-hmm. that since I was about 14, I think. <laughs> But uh, have you considered getting a Fitbit? One of these fit. You've got one. You do. I so like, yeah. It's so like I'm. I'm probably so like I've got more to lose than than just that. So yes. I'm just going to get stuck in and. Yeah. Um, well, all, I, all I'm good. saying that for is it's a really good motivator it, mm-hmm. it, it, because if you if you set out to do, as an example, ten thousand steps a day, which is like five miles, or or if on a on a walk you want to do like fifteen miles. It, mm-hmm. it, and, it, and you, if you use it properly and put your food calorie in and it will tell you how many calories you've burned off yeah. and, it, and you can watch your weight going down and you can, you can monitor it all and you, you, your iPhone does all the, all the writing down you don't need to write anything down it tells you all your That's why it's good patterns. for keeping yeah. a log so like a yeah, thing but yeah. I thought I'd just um, 150 get myself quid, yeah, committed it's, to it yeah, so yeah, I can yeah, yeah. It's a great motivator and the weight will drop off you because you'll suddenly, you'll suddenly realise that, that you know, yeah, this is this is great, you know, and you and you yeah, feel absolutely. so much better, honestly. You know, you really. Do. Well, I just feel a lot better just coming out today. Yes. Okay, it's a little bit cold, but yes, it is. You know, yes. so like you wrap yes. up warm, so yeah, like and you do, off yeah. you go. Yeah. yeah. As long yeah. as you've got some good shoes. And yep, that's right. That's right. And the necessary so like waterproof stuff. So I, where are you heading now? You're down to water. We're going round so like all the way down to um, water. Holly, Holly Hill Park. All oh, right. Okay. So we're going to go up round there through the park, <coughs> and then back on towards home. Right. So it's well, about it's, eight miles or so. Well, that's that's perfect. Mm. That's perfect. We're doing another walk tomorrow in Arundel, aren't we? Yes. Right. In where? So, sorry. Uh, Arundel, Swan Right, Lake. Arundel. So, right. Wow, that, that's that's brilliant. Well. Well, it's been a pleasure meeting you. And, and you and, as well. And, and uh, I hope we'll stay in touch. And, you know, you've got a card, have a look. And, yeah, sure. and absolutely, send me a message absolutely. to say that you've had a look. And that would okay, be very nice. Sure. Lovely. Okay. Thank you very much. Okay, okay. thank you. Bye. Bye now. Bye. All the best. So this is Jenny on the right and this is Linda on the left. And they're, they're doing a walk around the Norfolk coast. And, and so what's your plans today? Uh, well, we've walked from... Uh, wells at the moment yes. and we're walking to Cly yes. um, today and we're just looking for a nice pub to have a shandy in at the moment. Right, yeah. oh, well, I think I've just mentioned there's yeah. one about 300 yards yeah. on my shoulder so That's we should right. be okay there. Yeah. So is this kind of coastal path walking, have you been doing this kind of thing for long? Uh, only about two hours. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking more like years, actually. You're, you're experienced walkers, obviously. We walk a fair bit. We walk a bit, yeah. 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 We do. We, yeah. We've done from Sunny Honey yes. to Wells right. over the, a few weekends ago. Yeah. Yes. And now we're heading towards Blakeney and then Clyde. Yes. And then tomorrow we're doing Clyde to Cromer. Right. It, um, it, so this is obviously a, one of your favourite coasts. Oh, it's fabulous, lovely. Yeah. It's just lovely. I can't think why everybody says it's boring in Norfolk because I think it's just beautiful here. Yeah. Yeah. It is really lovely. Well, I think every county's got its own it particular has, sort of thing. Hasn't and it? and the birds and everything. The last time we came was when we heard all the cuckoos, wasn't yeah. it? Yeah. And uh, we were lucky enough to see a, a cameraman, a photographer, who was very keen, and he showed us a really good close-up of a cuckoo, which I've never actually seen before. Wow. So that was really nice. Yeah. That was a good experience yeah oh that's fantastic but we hope to do the coast to coast one we're hoping uh, to do the coast to coast, oh, coast. we're right. going to start it in the west side september october yeah but it might take us five years yeah right <laughs> yes that's the one that runs that runs to uh let me just fit robin hood's bay and yes. it yeah, starts off in right. westmoreland well yes Cumberland. yes yeah. it does st bees is it bees bees yeah 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 yes well i walked past st bees in the early days of this one how long have you been walking then uh, 15 months now. <gasps> Have you really? Yes. Wow. Oh my goodness. And I've got my camper van with me, so what ah. I do is the, 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 I drive from A to B with a van, leave right. the van, then right. get a bus Fantastic. back to A and then walk. And yeah. it's, it's by far the cheapest and easiest way yeah, of doing it. Yeah, fabulous. And yeah. I've got right around the coast by doing that. That is a fabulous yeah. thing and, to do. And I walk right through the winter as well through Cornwall, which is the perfect time to do it because you'd never do it during the summer. No, it's too no. crowded. Um, Are you doing it for a charity? Yes, I'm doing it for brain cancer research oh. fund. My oh. wife. 
yeah. my wife got a tumour. Yeah. She's had it removed successfully. Oh, that's, that's good. That's that wasn't, brilliant. It was only two or three months ago, yeah. and, and she's she's recovering very nicely, slowly but nicely. You know, she's yeah. good. she's fine. And so oh, I, I think those surgeons you, and, and the fund yeah. deserve some 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 money. So yeah, do. I've given you those cards, and if, yeah. if you do want to do that, there's, there's there's details on there. Yeah. We do that. But it's been very nice meeting you, ladies. Thank I can you. see very that you're nice gagging for it. We are. We're, we're ready, ready to go into the pub now, you see. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. off yeah. you go then. That's right. the Lovely to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. Best to both Bye. Of you. Thank you very much indeed. Bye. 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 Funny enough, I haven't met many walkers today, but I've just met another two two ladies in very quick succession, and this is Alison. So where have you been today, Alison? From Aberdawan to here, about 15 miles. Right, that's good going then. You, you... Not bad, because I'm carrying a tent. Wow. So how heavy is that? About 10, 15 kilos? No, less than that. Right, eight, right, maybe. okay. Yeah, so are you, doing the, are you doing the whole Welsh coast? Or In stages. Yes. yes. Okay. Where are you from, Alison? Bath. Oh, for really? Yeah. You've got some nice walks down there, though, haven't I've you? I've got some beautiful walks down there, but I'm slowly walking the whole coast path and then maybe the whole of the British coast. Well, English coast. Yes. Not British. Scotland's. Watch that. English and it, Wales. It's quite Wales. interesting, really. I started yeah. from Hull and walked up to Berwick and then okay. from Carlisle I've walked south and. Yeah. Uh, I, I've, I I've had Scotland two days of much. rain. Yeah, well, it it, it was. I, I decided against yeah. Scotland. Too much coastline. Yeah, much, too much coastline. and the logistics of it would be a nightmare. Yeah. Yeah. And you can't use your bus pass. Well, it won't, you no. wouldn't. It wouldn't affect you, but you can't use your bus pass in Scotland. So it makes a big difference. It's been lovely to meet you, Alison. And I know you're a bit tired. I'm, I'm the same now. So you know you've got a pitchy I tent, so, Yeah. Last two miles, tent. Lovely. Okay. Dinner. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet Thank you. Thank you. Bye bye. Well, I'm not far now from St Bride's Bay, and I'm making quite good progress from Norton Haven, and I've come across these two lovely people, who are from York. Mm -hmm. And your name, sir? Graham, Orton, Graham, and Mary. Mary. And Mary. <laughs> so you, you're just out for a, a, a little walk today, then, Graham? Yes, absolutely. The end of the end of the week, our week's holiday here. Yes. And we just wanted to make uh, take advantage of the weather. Glorious weather. Yes. I mean, it, it's turned it's turned really nice again for today. It I mean, has. Absolutely. I know the wind's blowing. It always does on the top of these cliffs. You but know, it's but not an icy wind, is it? It's it is an icy wind. wind. No. I mean, I'm down to just like a, a, it's the first, yes, the first well, day for I've a long time where I'm just down to a t-shirt. Yes, I've taken my jumper and, uh, off. Yeah. <laughs> yes, yes. So you enjoy in this uh, nice, you know, glorious Pembrokeshire coast. Beautiful. It's, it's got a reputation for being the toughest walk in the country. Has it? Oh, yes. right, I didn't know that. Yes, mm -hmm. and uh, there's an awful lot of German people. There's a group of Germans, uh, two or three different groups of German people. They right. seem to love it here. Yes, it's amazing. Uh, you know, uh, yeah, they find out about it. But on yes. saying that, you know, on this walk, I've met people from all over the world. You know, so. Have you been walkers over the years? Then is it we're, we're short, we're short walkers. You know, we, we, you were in the walking club, weren't we? Mm, yeah. Just home. Just and, gentle. Yes. Just yes. About as we got older. Eight to nine miles. <laughs> <laughs> no, well, that's fair enough. Yes. I mean, York. You're not far from my stopping ground in Hull. I'm from Hull. Hull. So, yes. I used to spend all my life on York railway station. Did you? Yeah, yes. When I was a teenager. I used to do train spotting yes, when yeah, I was yeah, younger. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I think once a train spot, always. I, do it. I still enjoy you? train yes. journeys. You know yes. Oh, yes. It's interesting. We watch Michael Patillo's train journeys with. Oh yeah, yeah, love, love yeah, those, uh, yeah, he does such a good job. Oh, he does absolutely, mm. yes, yes, fabulous. Yes. yes. Well, it's been a pleasure to meet yes, you. Yes. Nice meeting you yes. too. Thank you Surprise, very much. Yes. And, and don't forget to tell your grandkids that you're on YouTube. No, no. right. <laughs> that will make them laugh. <laughs> it will. Okay. It will. Thank you very much. <laughs> Hi, Thank Thank you. Thank you. Anyway. and Rachel, and the mother and daughter. So. Eileen, can you tell me about one or two of your experiences where you've done something like this before? You mentioned he was in India. Oh, oh yes, that, that was the most magnificent <laughs> thing. It wasn't walking, it was cycling. Yeah. 25 miles up and 25 miles down every day, 50 yeah. miles. And the, the highest we got was, we started from Sikkim in the west, and if you could call it a road, but it was, <laughs> of sorts. Yes. Right across Bhutan. Yeah, a track and, kind of thing. And yeah, then yeah. down into uh, India, Assam, and right. on to Gujarati, and then back to Delhi. Oh. It was wonderful, and everybody should have to do it. Compulsory. Yeah. I, I like <laughs> the sound of government that. Government decree that. Yeah. yeah, they should. It was absolute. And somebody said, "What do you want to go there for?" Well, most of the countries I go to are for the culture. Yes. Okay, for the cycling, yes, and the walking. But the culture interests me very much, and yes. it did. Yeah, Fascinating. That, yeah. That's very interesting. Yeah. And so, do, do you both do a lot of walking together? Um, not really. Not really, because I don't have time. Um, but we've been to the Lady Street, haven't we? Oh, we're the Lady Street. Yeah, yeah, yeah I and we yeah. go with my kids to the Lake District. We did this last year, didn't we? Yes, we did it in March last year. So we're staying yeah. at Boggle Hall tonight in the youth hostel. Oh, that's a lovely place. And then coming, yeah. Yeah. And then yeah. coming yeah. back tomorrow. Just past there. Yeah. There was yeah. a, load of, a load of school kids actually yes. in from Leeds and they left 
just as I was leaving, and they all came swarming across the bridge as I was walking across the bridge. Yeah, no, she's I had a right go at I think they might be there tonight as well, actually. Oh, well, no, really? I don't think so, because there was a couple of coaches oh. up the hill. Oh, really? Oh, right. And, and that they, were, they were making oh, the way really? to the coaches, oh, so right. it I looks as if you're going to have a quiet night. <laughs> we are booked in, of course. Two coaches, well, that's only about 100 kids. Yeah, you don't want to be there with 100 no. you know, teenagers. I've been there, done that, but not yeah, with yeah. 100. I hope not, no. <laughs> anyway. So today you're just walking Whitby to Robin Hood's Bay? At Boggle Hall. Oh, bigger part Yeah, Boggle Hall, yeah. And then walk back tomorrow. Well, there's just another bit we can do off the track, isn't there? Different track, put it that way, from Boggle Hall. Instead of coming oh, back. Oh, to come back around yeah. by Filingthorpe. Yes. And walk back that way, yeah. Which is like part of the old Likewake walk, really. Yes, that's right. Mm. You pass, pass the telephone mast. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, I've done the Likewake several times mm. over the years mm. as, as a fundraising thing for a football team. Oh, yeah. Yeah. But, I've not uh, done yeah. that one, I've heard plenty about it. But yeah. yeah. Well, it's more of a. It, it, it's specially put together, I think. I don't think mm. it was intended as that, but ah, sure. 42 miles in 18 hours, and you get a little coffin badge. And it is a good way of getting sponsorship. Of course, it is. Yeah, you know, if, you, if, if all the footballers achieved it, yeah. they'd get 10 quid off indeed, somebody else. And, indeed, and, and, yeah. And, oh, yeah. You know, it's a really good way of raising That's money. That's a good thing, yeah. Really so, good. can I ask you a really personal question? Then? Oh, no. How old are you then? If oh, you don't... Dear me. oh, well, father always used to say, my father, when we asked him, um, uh, as old as my tongue and a little bit uh, younger than my teeth. <laughs> right. So and how old's that? Have I got it the right way around? That is the right way, because I've got that experience. Dad used to yeah. say that to us. Yeah, yeah. But uh, it doesn't matter really, I'm 78. 78. 79 this year. Well, you're wearing really well. It's my 70th this year, which is why I'm doing this walk. I see. Yeah. Yeah. Just, just to get out. Yeah. Yeah. Just to get out, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 OK, well, it's right. been an absolute then pleasure meeting yes, you. Yes, you too. Uh, oh, 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 I'm no. 47. <laughs> 40, oh, I've got a daughter, 46, I think. All right, yeah. yeah, yeah. Born yeah. in 73, so you... Same, same yeah, era. Yeah, yeah, same era. Same era, yeah. 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 Lovely. Lovely. Right. Very nice to meet nice you, ladies. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Have yeah. a nice day. Enjoy the rest of the day. Yeah, and have a look at my site. I will do, yes. I'll put that safe, yeah. Thank you very much. Yeah, thank you. Bye now. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Well, this is a good start of the day. I'm, I'm down here on Leon Sea asking directions mainly for a cup of tea and a sandwich or a cafe. They all seem a little bit upper class further down the street there, like nine quid a time. I'm not, I'm not up for that. But I, mo I bumped into this young lady called, sorry? Kelly. Kelly. And she's from Grimsby. So, so what are you doing down here then, Kelly? So I um, moved to London about 10 years ago. And last year, my husband and I decided to sell our flat and move to Lee. So a lot of our friends are from Essex, so we now, well it's usually a bit quieter, but um, yeah. I'm just on my way to work now into That's London. Right. Um, but it was nice to meet you. Well, it's, it's nice to meet you. And yeah, well. congratulations on everything you're doing and on your wife and your father-in-law's recovery. Thank you very much indeed. Well, I've done 3,000 miles now. I'm finding Essex very frustrating because there's <laughs> not much of a coastal path anyway. No, you're uh, in the right place now. Yes. So I'm heading for, going to be heading for Chelmsford perhaps later today. Nice. There's an awful lot of noise, Kelly. I'm really yeah, sorry about Yeah, the bin man, um, bin man today. Yes. But definitely, take yourself down here. Yes. Um, it won't be Grimsby prices, but it's definitely I not London prices. Back, I know, I know. And then the coastal walk along the sea wall will be yes. lovely. Yes, that's what I'm looking forward to. Great. I, I did it all the way out to Shubri Nash the other day, and it, oh, that perfect. was nice. You know, it was a lovely night, but yeah. it's, it's got to be done. And then I'm heading for Chelmsford. Good. Lovely to meet you. You too. Best of luck. Thank you very much. Take care. Right, Mark and Joe, and I'm not that far now from Lowestoft, and. Uh, Mark seems to be, not I wouldn't say an expert, I'm not being disrespectful, but he seems to know an awful lot <laughs> about bit. this this beach that we're standing on. Can you can you tell me again, Mark, about what, what's, what's happened here? That a well, this is Kesenland Beach. Um, we've lived in the village 20 years. Yeah. When we first moved in, there wasn't a beach here, so everything that you can see here has moved in and moved along the coast from Ben Acre in the last 20, 30 years, and us wow. moving towards Lowestoft. Hopefully, uh, in 20 years' time, that'll be changed here again, and uh, well, lower yeah, stuff might have a huge impressive. beach as well. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's that, that's amazing, isn't it? Yeah, it is. And, and I know, you know, I mean, you two are out for a walk today. Is this one of your regular walks? Yes, it is. Yeah. 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 yeah, regular walk and regular dog walk. This is as a well. real dog walkers' beach here because they're so wide and open. People can avoid each other if they want to, or they can walk with each other. So yes, that's a sociable or yes. unsociable space. However you want to do it. Yes, it just seems like you know, it, it's almost like. Uh, 
It's bizarre, isn't it? The, the, the way the way nature has changed it all You've around. You've got Arctic terns being protected over there as well, because that's one of the. It just spin round. Yeah, there's a fence over there. I don't know if that will show up. Oh can, yes, I can see. Yeah. Um, there's Arctic terns are being protected there, so it's all ah. fenced off because I have about about 40 or 50 pairs of Arctic terns. Yes. Um, as there is yeah. not many of them left in the wild in this country, so every year that fence goes up, and whilst they're nesting, they actually protect them there. Right. Yeah. That's amazing. And so, uh, you know, you're saying you've lived here 20 years and all this kind of stuff. I mean, I, I do you originate from this area then? Just inland, about 20 miles away, a little uh, market town called Harleston. Oh, so right, not right. too far away. Right, right. No. Right. Because we surf, and that, the surf used to be really, really good here. Oh, yeah, really? So we yeah. moved here for surf. <laughs> yeah. And, and now, now it's gone. Now it's gone. <laughs> yeah. Have you thought about Cornwall? Or, or we yeah. have, yes. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's, they've got it down there, haven't they? Yeah. I mean, I've just walked around Cornwall during yeah. the winter, and they were still surfing in the middle of January and oh, stuff. Yeah. You know, yeah. Everyone yeah. we know who's around. moved up yeah. there has working two jobs to actually stay down there, and they get yeah. in less than what we get in around here because they're working all the time. So right. we can drop everything and go surfing for here. So Right. Yeah. That's a terrific that's accent you've got there. <laughs> now, the, what, what's this rock ca- concert thing that's going on today? Uh, the, it's the first... Uh, what's first it called? First Light. First Light. So it's celebrating the solstice. And they're oh, basically ah. trying to get interest in Lowestoft to regenerate it because Lowestoft's a little bit run down. Right. Um, so they've got a myriad of stages and uh, performers. And that's the first one today. It runs from 12 o'clock today to 12 o'clock tomorrow. They're right. running right through the night. Um, performers, cinema, dancing, you name it. But we're going to see what's going on and oh, get excellent. a pint as well. Oh, well, I'll come and have a pint with you then. <laughs> Sounds like a plan. If, 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 is, it, is it free admission? It yes, is, it yeah. Is, yeah. Oh, I was going to yeah. say, do, so I, do I need my bus pass? Do I, get, do I get a pensioner's <laughs> discount? You can try. You can try that with your pint, maybe. <laughs> yeah. All right, well, thanks. Lovely, lovely to meet you. And you don't okay. mind me no walking worries. with you. you know, no, that'll be lovely. No, Thank you very fine. much. Thank you. So, your name is? I'm Caroline. Caroline. I'm Emma. And Emma. And you're out on a little bit of a walk walk. today. She's trying to kill me. We're going on holiday stones, so we're getting getting our motor bodies on. Oh, that's a good idea. Well well done to you, mate. How was it? Oh, thank you very much. Yeah, you you. keep it up. Yeah. So this is your first real walk then? Yeah, for uh, about 15 years. (laughs) So how are you doing with it? So that's why I've got the 80s throwback flares on. Oh, the 80s. (laughs) 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 Not wrong with that, love. Now, well, the best of luck to you. Thank you. Cheers now. Bye. Bye. So I'm back on the top of this hill again and I've just met a nice, very nice young lady and now I've met Mike who's walking a couple of dogs. And So do you live locally, Mike? Yes, I do. I live in Studland. I, we lived here, we've had a house here over 30 years. Wow. And, you, and this is a regular thing for you to be taking the dogs for a walk and a bit of exercise as well? Absolutely. Then. Usually round old Harry Rocks, which is where you're going to be work, walk, walking shortly. Um, yes. But it's one of the most beautiful places in the country. Yes. And you were telling me just a couple of minutes ago that you, you're, you're a former marathon runner. Runner. Oh, former, yeah, a long, long time ago. You know, yeah. I, my best times were um, in the late 30s and early 40s, and I'm now 75, so I've run for a long, long time. Wow, <laughs> you're looking well on 75, mate. You're looking well, re- and and now, now I notice you're into birds and bird watching and that kind of thing. I am indeed. I do quite a lot of wildlife photography as a hobby, and uh, yes. this is an ideal place to be for doing that. It's wonderful. Oh, that, that's excellent. Well, it's just a, a quick hello, but it's been a pleasure having a, a, a chat with you. I could stand here and talk to you for hours. Uh, likewise, um, but I guess you want to be getting on to Shell Bay now, don't you? <laughs> well, yes, and I want to go to Corfe Castle la- later on and, and, and film that as well, because you can't really go to Swanage without going and seeing Corfe Castle. No, and you've probably got a good day for it. If a few days ago and it had been smothered in mist, you wouldn't have seen it, but now yeah. the conditions are perfect. And that's Jim, right. I'd like to wish you all the best for the rest of your journey. Well, that's very kind of you, Mike. Thank you very much indeed. It's been that's a, pl- a pleasure. pleasure meeting you. And you. Thank you, thank you. Bye, Jim. Bye. Well, this is Andrea, and this is Joe. Hello. And I've just met them walking along. And so where are you off to today, then, Andrew? Uh, we're just oh, doing a section, sorry, of, section of the southwest coast, and so we're just heading just however long we want to walk, really. Until you run out of puff. Exactly Yeah, we that. find a good yeah. pub. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, well, that's, that's a good plan, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And so you avid walkers then, you do, do you do a lot of this kind of thing? We do towards this, this time of year, don't we, yeah. really? As yes. we're all sort of the winter period, to get out and about and get a few pounds off if we can. Yes. And um, keep mobile, really. Yeah, absolutely. That's what it's all about. 
Yeah. Um, not so much in the summer, but it's more of a winter thing, really, if I'm honest. Yes, well, that's, that's a good idea. Especially this, this part of the world, North Devon, North Cornwall. Yes. Uh, we have done the Jurassic Coast and Dorset as well. Right. Because um, we live sort of that way. Yes. So, uh, yeah, a bit of, bit of variety, really. But they're, they're both quite sort of uh, tough tough trails, shall we say. Absolutely. But, um, Absolutely. Yeah, it keeps us going, really. Keeps but what fair. better views? Absolutely. Absolutely. Oh, it's Absolutely. Priceless. Priceless. It's fabulous. Yeah. And, and I mean, okay, so you know, I've I've walked right through the summer and had wonderful weather right throughout. Oh, I never I never expected it to last this long. No, no, it's, no. it's, it's, it's been and, fantastic. Uh, you yeah, know, it really has been, been absolutely amazing. I can't remember. I'm 70 years old and I can't remember. Mm. I can remember 1976. 76. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 76 yeah. was yeah. a good year, but, yeah. uh, but there's yeah, been I nothing like that since. That was, yeah. So yeah, long no. time ago. Yeah, it is, isn't it? Mm. Absolutely fantastic. Well done. Lovely to meet you. Yes, and you. Keep in touch. Nice to meet you. Send us a message that you're all right and stuff. Yeah. Follow on and hope hope you do the same. Cheers. Yeah. Indeed. Thank nice you very much. Bye nice bye. to meet you. Bye. bye bye now. Well, I'm just about to leave Amsterdam. It's just after eight o'clock, and I bumped into Claire, who's got this beautiful little dog here. Buddy. Who's Buddy? That's Buddy, is it? And he's waiting for you to come and throw some things <laughs> in. Hiya, Buddy. Hello. So, are you a local person then, Claire? Well, well, not really. I'm from Ayrshire on the west coast and I've never been to this area of Scotland before. Really? I'm proud to say I've been in a lot of places in Scotland and England and Wales, yes. but never this area of Scotland. Well, so, it's amazing. beautiful. It I is. never realise why people keep coming back year after year. Well, it's funny you say that because people were saying to me, oh, it's much nicer on the west coast. Right. Um, and I thought, well, what do you mean by much nicer you know because every every inch of the way from Berwick to here has been absolutely fabulous uh -huh. I mean this Fife coastal path is really well defined it is there's loads of lovely things to see yeah. every you know every mile you've got something uh -huh. of real interest I think it's, it's the scenery off the coast and the west coast that makes it more beautiful yes because of what you're looking at all yeah. the islands yes absolutely but this is great and it's drier on the east coast apparently yeah. so well, that's incredible isn't it get back up the umbrellas was you here for the rain yesterday oh to travel in it yesterday didn't it rain it couldn't have rained any harder i've never seen rain like that in a long time so yes hopefully there'll be no more of it the strange thing is my system worked the heavy rain but as soon as it got bright and sunny again it just went off oh really yeah the signal just disappeared oh. so you know and i've been banging on about this to a lot of people probably fed up of hearing me talking about this mm -hmm. but it is a problem and but i'm getting over it in small doses right like today i'm going to walk to crail uh-huh see what the weather's like see what yeah. the signal's like and then i'm going to walk back and get my van and then take it to crail and then go up to st andrews so that if the weather does because it's forecast a bad forecast for today yeah. but look at it well i know and the forecast was bad last week but it was really just showery, yes. you know, so if you happen to miss it, it, the weather was fine. Yes. So whereas yesterday there was no escaping that bad. Yes, that's amazing. It's a real storm. Well, it's been very nice meeting you. You you've too. Got, you've got a card. Send yes. me a message, keep in touch. Brilliant, all the very best. Thank Your you very walk. much. Bye, Jim. Bye now, bye. bye. Off he goes. There he is, he's happy now, look. Go on, chuck a stone in, let's see him go. <laughs> <laughs> Bye.